Bush, right? Yes. How did that happen? It actually goes back to Franklin Pierce, the ex-president from way back, which is one of my grand grandmother's ancestors. So it's always been a name that's meant a lot to me. And I wanted to... Verse. All right, and here we go. I'll check back with, with you guys on Saturday for my winning numbers. Back to you. <laughs> de la próxima semana. Pronóstico de lluvia tenemos acumulados que podrían sobrepasar hasta las tres pulgadas. Si usted está en casa ahora, le invito a que salga a la ventana para que vea nuestra gente de New York. Amanecen con 63 grados de temperatura, un cielo. Just about 9.30 this Sunday evening. Let's get some of our top stories from this weekend. Power lines in Santan Valley went down last night near Hunt Highway Power Road. Serial killer is now off the streets in Stockton, California. He is accused of shooting and killing multiple men in the last year. David Daniel has the latest on how police managed to catch that suspect. Red carpet for former President Donald Trump. Trump held a political rally in the East Valley today. Some supporters waiting hours in line. As we get ready for Super Bowl 57 right here in the Valley today, we're learning more about the events planned across the Valley ahead of the big game. Drawing is today, and no one has won this jackpot since early August. And storm that's going to slam the Pacific Northwest by Sunday of this weekend, and that will target Arizona by the middle of next week. A lot to work out with the details of that storm system in terms of how much rain, how reverted here. And yeah, Katie, scare for sure. This could have been so much worse. The Valley seen its share of hot air balloon mishaps, including some leading to fiery and deadly crashes. This, though, looked more like something out of a movie. Witnesses I spend over spend. I spent like $5 or less. I don't go crazy because I'm like, I'm not going to lose yeah. money. But a lottery winner in China showed up in a mascot costume to claim his 30.6 last weekend. Several people were injured that day, but one man, Gabriel Sotelo, died. Holly Bach spent time today with his wife and his daughter. daughter. Uh, this is so sad. No yeah. Daryl J. Cunningham. Happy, Happy Thanksgiving! Thanksgiving. <laughs> Yay, it's the day, my favorite holiday, probably it's, one of yours. It's one of my many favorite holidays. <laughs> Every day, you're like, it's my favorite holiday. I'm like, that was their last holiday. Oh, no, you can never have Online shopping is setting records this year. That, though, is opening the door for scammers. The National Retail Federation reports... Well, in their courtroom. Well, then the county attorney's office hired her to prosecute death penalty cases, but they failed to effectively check for conflicts. And as ABC 15... She meal of the day, but the staff at a Brazo Central campus taking that idea to another level. Yeah, the hospital kicked off its Healthy Over Hungry cereal drive with a cereal. It's beautiful. Day. Why are we in here? Let's take the show outside. I know, right? It, it was beautiful.